What? He's not allowed to record inside the building. Inside the building? No. Why is that? Because. Uh oh. What's that mean? Alright. Where's that sign at? Again, I got your phone. Where, Please do not step inside the area. Gotcha. I did see a sign that says no entry on the... Well, that, no, yeah, see, look at that. Shout out Angry Vet Audits. You never like those guys. Or the police. Yo, body cam off so my camera stays on. Crooked ass cops won't like this song. Gotta film the police when they do something wrong. I'ma film the police when they do something wrong. This is Angry Vet Audits, and I'm out here with Anthony X in Danville, California at the post office on Camino Tassajara. We are going to see if they respect our rights to peacefully film in public. Don't forget to like, share, and comment on this video. And if you want to see future content, please subscribe to Anthony X and Angry Vet Audits. Mount up and get ready for the ride. Greeting cards and featured items here. Some holiday packaging. Some old documents. Other items, it looks very bare here. Inside the building? No. Why is that? Because it's, it's a government building. I thought it was a public public area. No, it's not. It's huh? a federal it's building. Federal building? Yeah. Isn't that public? No. So we're not allowed in here, people? No, Publix. you're allowed, but you're not allowed to record. Why is that? I'm just curious. Who are you guys yeah. for? Huh? Okay. 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 Yeah, sir, what's your... Do you mind if I see your ID, sir? <laughs> uh, no, I just want to know who you are and who you're with. No, Okay, man. why are you yeah, asking no. us? Hey, hey, have a good one, okay? Okay. Uh, what's that mean? Did you did you ring that bell, sir? Yeah, I did. What does that mean, though? I can help you with your sin. Oh, no, I got to pack something up. Pack you what? I need to pack up something to hand you to send it out. Hmm. Uh, there's some boxes in there. Yeah, right? thank you. Thank you. So this guy, he just rung a bell and said that uh, it's not a public area. Right there, see his boxes? Yes, thank you. I'm good. Thank you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he sees the boxes. There, buddy. Alright. Got a camera right there. So that's the first time I've ever heard someone ring a bell like that. That's crazy. So I think uh, that bell was to call that guy, whoever just came out. I hear them talking. Get a little self service key. Yeah. 
Sir, can I ask you a question? Was that like a panic alarm you just hit, or no, something where you need? No, I just needed to talk to him. Oh, so that's a bell you ring when uh, you need to talk to him? Yep. Okay. It's not for like emergencies? It's, schedule, no. it's not, oh, okay. employee there that came out when this employee rung the bell. They went to the back at a little brief discussion. Alright guys, we're at the back of the Downville Post Office on Tassahara Road. There's no signs or anything saying no trespassing or no unauthorized personnel at all. See a clear shot of both of the gates. As we can see here, it looks like the bay is open. This one says, no, that's just, that's the exit. It makes it sound like And this is the entrance. That's true. Interesting. It's like that door open. There's no sign saying staff only. It's not locked or anything. Hmm. This is very interesting. Little back area right here. Oh, we got someone coming in code three, guys. Coming in hot. Give me, sir, this is employee area only. Oh, yeah, we're not going to go in there. We're not going to go in there. Yeah, we're not going to go inside. This parking lot is employee only. We have a sign there. Where? Where? Can you show me? Yes. Maybe I missed this it. This area is for employee only. Maybe I missed it. I didn't see anything. Does it say no trespassing or? Yeah, it's for employee only, sir. This is a lot of public area. Sure, it looks like it. Hmm. So Amazon people don't come back here to drop off packages or? Yeah, this is going on me, sir. Let's see where this magic sign is. Maybe I missed it. Uh, He's going all the way out to oh. the town. I can't walk Why up did there. You come from there sir? Yeah. I didn't come from way up there. I just came from this right here. This is not a walkway. This I is just came from this right little here. stepping stone right here. And the signs right I right came from this little walkway right, right here. here. It's called a road. See the little stepping and stone? And a stepping stone to step across. That's where I came from, sir. I have informed you this is a private area. No, no, sir. No, no. You know, most of the private areas, they have the, the United States Postal No Trespassing signs. Where's that yeah. sign at? Again, I inform you, Where, please do not step inside the area. Gotcha. We appreciate you uh, letting us know. Thank you. Hey, are these cherries? And there might be a sign up there, but if I, have, if I had to guess, guys, I could be wrong. I didn't look. It might say something like, I can take her vehicle, but it's not open for parking. Hello. Vehicle 2, 2, 1, 3, 5, 8, 1. Oh. Hey, how you doing? Good, thank you. How are you Do you have a good day out there? Yes. Excellent. Are you guys the new officers of the uh, union? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're just, We're just out here taking there. pictures. There's no signage saying we can't be here. Just taking a tour. Probably like 10 minutes we'll be gone. It's getting yeah. late. Do you have any grievances you want to tell us about <laughs> while we're here? <laughs> That's our supervisor. Yeah, but tell us before he comes. Yeah, I, I, won't we'll we'll I won't tell him. I won't tell him anything you tell me. Oh, it's a secret, you. all right? Thank Look at my zip my lip. Nice meeting you guys. All right. Very nice, guys. Very we nice employee. Supervisor, Robocop over there. Mm -hmm. Again, I just want to point out, from where we came, there's even a stepping stone. There's no, no trespassing signs. Uh, 
Alright, looks like some more to... Oh. She's like, why do you have this one there? And she pointed back here, kind of like... Oh, that was us? Yeah. So oh. he's on the phone, guys. He's not happy. The technical group, nothing saying I can't even go in. Oh, it says no entry, but that's just what ABA pointed out. That's like, this is entered. Yeah. But there's no actual sign of saying I can't go in here. But, you know, I'm going to respect some... I have, I have more of guys. But the open parking lot, that's common sense. I mean, that's just... It's open. He's either calling the postmaster, or maybe he's the postmaster. Maybe he's calling the PD. He's gonna have a nice story to tell his uh, his family when he gets home. Mm -hmm. like, uh, caught some guys taking pictures in public. It was horrible. I defended the post office of Danville on El Camino Tassajara, all with my hand on my Let's pocket sure he's, and he's... the other hand on my phone. <laughs> Videos of Cal OSHA clients. That might be a different area. Let's get out of here with you. Okay, okay. We don't want to disrupt any business here. There you go. Here comes another vehicle. Excellent. Well, very fast for a parking lot. Oh, I need more speed bumps. Alright folks, so we are still in the parking lot here. We're gonna go around the corner. Well of course guys, if the police do come, I'm gonna come in front of the Oh, here's the loading dock. There's the guy who was uh, speeding through the parking lot. I don't know what that guy said. He said something about inside. All right, guys, he's still on the phone. Uh, Now he's uh, giving a description. I heard him say white shorts, black shirt. Well, he's on the phone with the PD then. I don't need the PD or sheriff department. He's well over, over, kind of isolated. It could be the Angela PD, it could also be uh, the sheriff department. So he just hung up the phone. Now he's talking to the guy uh, who came in a couple minutes ago. The guy with the black coat and gray pants with his hands in his pockets. And now the guy we saw in the loading dock is pointing to the loading dock, talking about us, most likely, being out there. Which is, you know, he has the right to be concerned. He didn't react crazy when we were out there. Just went about his work. All right, guys, he followed us out here. I think he's trying to see where we go because the police are coming so he wants to be able to give a direction of travel so folks we're going up here to see if there actually is a sign 
you know, again, we did not come in through that way. We came in from right next to the post office. There's even a little stepping stone across that. So why is this a uh, customer entrance? But that's like if you want to get a stamp or mail a package or pick a package up. Nothing to do about employees only. No trespassing. Oh, There's wow. On the ground here. This sign right here says authorized vehicles only, but that's referring to vehicles. Nothing to do with pedestrians. Yeah. He, he said there was an employees only sign, folks. We walked up here. It says authorized vehicles only, customer entrance only. This is crazy. It's like uh, we have Danville PD showing up. private property and we're like we're just walking around okay. yeah you want to let him know for us yeah i'll go talk to him do you know uh, who it is in there i can point him out as a supervisor he's wearing some slacks and a sh he was back there if you turn around you can go in right here Let me yeah get the parking spot so I don't all right This officer knows what time it is. As soon as he saw me with the camera, he got on his radio right away. He's probably like, it's just those fucking guys. Probably not here. 02267. You said he was back here? He was, yeah. Well, How's your guys' day going? Good, Good so far. Appreciate you. I'm just sorry they had to waste resources like this. And as you can see, like for most post offices, there's no federal property, like no trespassing signs. Yeah, I don't see anything either. I'll go talk to them. We try to obey, you know, our best to obey the law and yep. be respectful. You have a good day out there? Long day. Yeah. It's a long day. At least it's a magic moment almost, right? You get to go home pretty soon. <laughs> Maybe two more hours here. Let's see. We see him or not? Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Okay. Look at okay. the supervisor. Oh, okay. Yeah, you guys had a supervisor that I called us. Can you uh, find okay, him? Okay, he was. He was walking around here a few minutes ago. Yeah. Was he? Do you see what it looked like at all? Oh, here he comes. Oh, here he goes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. I'll talk to him. Hello. 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 But legality-wise, in order to keep people from walking back there, the gate either has to be shut and locked, or you have to have signage up that says no, you can't be back here. Okay. So, um, and we're not, just out of respect, we're not going to walk through here and disturb them or anything. I appreciate that. Um, so, they have every legal right to be back here since there is no signage up there. And I'll talk to the postal inspector about that. It looks like they gave the, their dispatch gave us a phone number, so I'll call them and follow up with them regarding that. Okay. But since there is no signage, they do have every legal right to be back here. Um, but in the future, signage uh, can get put, put up there, and then that can we'd be able to keep people from being back here. And the same thing if you guys have your drivers lock the gate in between going in and out. And to clarify, when he says signage, it's not just like you can't just print something up on your computer. It's got to be official government, no trespassing, you know, private property type of signage with a statute or penal code under it. Uh, yeah, I'll give him a call too. All right. I appreciate it. Do you have a yeah. register registration? Yeah. And can I get the call number? Uh, yeah, I got to go to my call number. Perfect. I'm not going to waste uh, radio traffic over that. So I'll no, get definitely. It. I hear you. I'll get it to my computer though. Yeah, I'll give him a call. Yeah. 
keep this officer uh, over there in Cleveland so that he can get back to a fight on real Friday. Uh, it's not his fault he got called here, guys. He has to come out. Call him on his, uh, his radio. It sounds like he had informed everyone. And just those guys with cameras, code 4. And again, you can see this is where we came through. There's a little walkway. Oh, looks like a backup here. There he is, Officer Backup. Hey, how's How it going? Doing? It'll get cold out there? Oh, it gets cold. The motorcycle? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, it gets cold. What do you do when it rains, man? Do you still got to work out there or do you get to, like, get a vehicle? Or I get something? the car. Get a car I get it nice and warm. That'd be car. dangerous, too. Nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we don't we don't ride in the rain. Just because gotcha. it's going to be wet. All right, gentlemen. All right. Here's my business card. Name's on the top. I wrote my employee number under my last name right there. Perfect. And then the incident number is ran right there in the middle. Gotcha. Let me just get a quick shot. Make sure it matches. Hope so. Yeah. Name's there and my name's right there. Perfect. Last name's rolling. There's that. That right there. And yeah. do you have a business card when, by any chance? When you... What is that? Sorry, do you have a business card by any chance? Uh, appreciate right. you. And real quick, you guys. Oh, are, no, I don't want to waste resources. Been, uh, that extremely just... cordial, respectful. I just got to ask you though, since I'm here, yeah. uh, you guys don't have anything on your persons or in your vehicles that you shouldn't have, uh -huh. do you? Uh, no. You're good. Yeah, yeah, you guys mind no, popping? Can I take a quick peek? Well, that's not my car. Yeah, no, that's what I'm asking. Can <laughs> I take a, I'm not gonna go in, but can I just take a peek to make sure there's no alcohol you can or the windows if you want? There. Well, yeah, of course <laughs> I could do that, that. But if you could pop the trunk where you guys I'm hide here, stuff, right? no. Yeah. I tried. I tried. It's just try. All right. No, they're being cool guys. They're being respectful of our rides. We appreciate it. Looks like the complaint was unwanted. Yes. Yeah, code four. We don't All right. Uh, well, we're gonna head out of here. Do you guys have any other questions? Right no, here? we're good. We appreciate you uh, honoring yeah. your oath and respecting our rights. We, we truly do appreciate it. We're yeah. not here to cause trouble. Well, yeah. Just know, exercise man, our rights. Yeah. What's your guys' uh, YouTube channel? I watch uh, a lot of the YouTube. You guys have a YouTube channel? Right? No, I'm more on TikTok. Yeah. TikTok? Yeah. yeah. TikTok. Yeah. See, I need to get my followers up because they don't let me do live on. Oh, okay. TikTok. Yeah, you know, I've seen, yeah. I've seen some channels like, out there on TikTok, yeah. actually, where there's, like, officers and stuff. Yeah. And I've heard of some getting in some uh, serious trouble for it, but I don't know why. If you're doing it in your... I guess if you're doing it on the cloth, but no, it's your personal well, sign. Yeah, no, like, not, like... Especially if you're doing it in a nice, cordial way where, you're, you know, you're, you're building that relationship with the community. Yeah. Nothing yeah. wrong with that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, back in the old days, a lot of people wanted to be a fireman or a cop, and nowadays there's such a disconnect between law enforcement yeah. in general. Oh, so no, it's good big, to build that bond. Big. It's, yeah. it's big, and it's yeah. it's a misconception of what you see on like in movies, gotcha. and what, what certain people will, will put out there. But it's like if we're gonna put everything out there, let's put everything out there. Yeah, right? definitely. Do we, are, are there uh, people that probably shouldn't be doing the job? Yeah, but yeah definitely. You know. Now let me ask you this: another question. I know you, I can go on forever, but if you guys, that either one of you had to ever uh, either confront or possibly even turn in a bad officer. Or a minimum. Uh, I've, never, minimum. Yeah, I've never had to do minimum, that Minimum. I don't want to throw them under the bus. Or minimum, just say, hey, you know what, man? You can't be doing that. Like, you're going to get me in trouble. You're, you're going to get in trouble. Stop doing it. No, in my honest, uh, you know, like just what I've seen mm -hmm. uh, in this department. Pretty good. I haven't. Perfect. And, you know, I can't say that for every guy. I haven't been everywhere. Yeah. But in this but from department, what you've seen. from what I've seen uh, personally, I have not had gotcha. to do that to anybody and tell somebody, hey, you need to simmer down, you know. Like, Perfect. So I've seen most people have been uh, respectful, have been cordial, and trying to, you know, really just trying to build that relationship with the community, right. to get people to know that we're, we are trying to do, you know, the Protect and serve, not harass and abuse. We're a hard job we're hired okay. to do. So. All right, guys. Hey, All right. Safe. You take care. Okay. Remember to put your right. seatbelt on, night, keep guys. your helmet on. Absolutely. <laughs> That's right. why I didn't take it off. I'm going to say this just joking, <laughs> but hey, you guys are dismissed. I'm not dismissed with you. <laughs> You guys have been cool. I appreciate you. I appreciate you guys. Have a good night. Yeah, good night. All right, guys. Uh, we're just going to go back in there real quick and do a quick victory lap. Um, just to show that we can't be run off public property. Just for peacefully recording. If we were sticking cameras in people's faces, climbing the wall, 
That's different, guys. Or we're just peacefully recording. Right, hold on, let me get your back there, man. Okay. Alright, get that. Alright, guys, I'm gonna call her the drive of honor. They honored their oath, they respected our rights. They weren't even trying to candy coat it. They weren't like, well, I wish there was something we could do. Yeah. Um, they just straight up told him, hey, he has a right to be there. They were biased. That's how it should be. Excellent service in the city of Danville. I don't want to check out his computer, but since he was so cool, guys, I'm not even going to bother him. The only tyrant we ran into was at the school board. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the field man. training officer. He know he wanted to do something. Well, All right, guys. Victory lap and we'll be on our way. We're out here for the victory lap. Police have left. Just want to walk through to show that we can't be run off. Looks like they closed the doors. Oh, it's still open. I see them back there. See a couple of heads moving around back there. Once they see that we're here, guys, there he is. There he is. We'll take off. We're not going to linger here all day. It's getting late. We got other places to go. It's a long drive. You can see him right over there. You know he's pissed, guys. He would have loved for us to be uh, shackled away. All right, guys, there he is. Pretty sure he saw us. He went back to his desk. We're taking off, guys. We appreciate you. Take care. All right. Good night, guys. Be safe, all right? This guy came around quick. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. That guy came through there quick. You know guys, we were just up here a little while ago. It looks like they were closed. Maybe uh, someone called. All right guys, so uh, here comes the Danville police again. It's a, looks like the same officer. He just drove through this little maintenance yard area for the city of Danville and came back out. It looks like the gate is still open. I don't know why it's open. It's almost like an invitation. All right, guys. That was the post office on Camino Tassajara in Danville, California. The first post office employee we encountered said no recording. Then the supervisor thought there was a sign saying employees only and called the Danville Police Department. They showed up and were very professional. They educated the postal workers and upheld our rights to peacefully record in public. Let me know what you think in the comments and don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. This is AVA out.